Thank you for joining Wars of the Roses. And this is Lenoir Alexander from the Encyclopedia Freemasonry by Albert G. Mackey. Lenoir Alexandre. A celebrated archaeologist who was born at Paris in 1761. Having studied at the Mazarin College, he entered the studio of Doyeu and successfully cultivated painting. In 1790, the National Assembly, having decreed that the treasures of art in the suppressed churches and convents should be collected at the Petits Augustins, he was appointed the conservator of the depot, which was subsequently called the museum, of which he was then made the director. He there collected more than 500 monuments rescued from destruction and classified them with great care. On the conversion of the Garden of Moasso into a museum of monuments, he was appointed one of the administrators and subsequently the administrator of the monuments of the Church of Saint Denis. In all these appointments, Lenoir exhibited his taste and judgment as an archaeologist. He was a member of the Society of Antiquaries of France, to whose transactions he contributed several memoirs. The Metropolitan Chapter of France had, from the year 1777, annually held philosophical conventions at which lectures on Masonic subjects were delivered by such men as Court de Gebelin. In 1789, these conventions were discontinued in consequence of the political troubles of the times. But they were renewed in 1812 by Monsieur Lenoir, who delivered before the chapter a course of eight lectures on the relations which exist between the ancient mysteries of the Egyptians and the Greeks and those of Freemasonry. In 1814, he published the substance of these lectures in a work entitled La Franche Maconnerie Rendue à sa Veritable Origin ou l'Antiquité de la Franche Maconnerie Prouvée par l'Explicatoire des Miafres Anciennes et Modernes. Paris, for quarto, page 304. The theory of the author being that the mysteries of Freemasonry are only a repetition of those of antiquity, he attempts to support it by investigations into the ancient initiations that are marked with profound learning, although the work was severely criticized in the Journal de Débat. He had previously published in 1809 a work in three volumes entitled Nouvelle Explication des Hieroglyphes aux Anciens Allégories Sacrées des Égyptiennes. He died at Paris, June 12th, 1839. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to share, like, subscribe and comment. And if you can, please consider donating to Wars of the Roses. Links to PayPal and Patreon are in the description. Thank you so very much.